going for healthy. Healthy fast food. Healthy fast. We love El Pollo Loco. But I want to get something I've never had. I don't know if it's all over the country. There's Maybe nobody not. behind us, so take all the time you want. I think you okay. ordered that with them, by the way. I ordered what? Up there. <laughs> you get something you don't normally get? I, I think driving, it's easier to eat a burrito or something. I always get the double chicken salad. It's delicious. Is that what you're going to get? No, because I'm trying to get something with salsa instead of dressing. They have a keto burrito. I don't know um, what that means, but they have one. I'm get gonna get that. A, get I'm a keto a, burrito. I'm what is that? A chicken avocado burrito. What about a keto burrito? I don't know what it is. Well, so I'm who not cares? Gonna... Let's get it. Okay, Steph's getting that, and I'm getting a chicken avocado regular one. It's going to have sauce in it I don't like. It has organic super greens, creamy cilantro, pico. Oh, I'm going to get that then. <laughs> it's got... What? Okay. It's got super greens, organic ones. I know. You, you need that. I've never heard of anything like that at a fast food. They got to have keto, you know. Okay, let's try that. I'm really good, thank you for asking. I'd like, uh, you getting one too? I, no, we have to try something different. You get that. I'm gonna get a keto burrito. I'm gonna get a chicken tinga. <laughs> and she's gonna get a chicken tinga. I get keto burrito and a chicken tinga. And, and do you like something to drink? Um, can I also get, you know your little street tacos? We got the avocado tacos, the keto tacos, and tacos al carbon. Al carbon. Can I get um, just like a la carte, a couple of them, in case I don't like the chicken tinga? I apologize for her yelling at you. Hey, what about a chicken tinga burrito, a keto burrito, and two tacos al carbon? Yeah. You want a drink? Do you like any salsa? Uh, no drink. Um, the green salsa, please. Green Do you like salsa. Your yes, that's it. That's it. Okay, no drink. Thank you. Thank you. Their green salsa. Oh, it's so good. Oh, it's like an avocado. Where'd my mask go? Here, use this mask. Mm -hmm. I use that to go in the restroom. Okay, mm -hmm. El Pollo. I don't think El Pollo Loco is everywhere. It's not? I don't think so. It might be a West Coast. It's good. Okay. Do I have some rewards? 20% off. Oh, $100. Hold okay. on. Uh oh. I need, I need to. I can't even pay. My purse is underneath the thing. Okay, one second. Sorry about that. Sorry. It, it was her turn to pay. <laughs> so I didn't have my card ready. Yeah. We just came this from mask a... This is like going in my eyeball. I know, we just came from a park with Putty and my purse is hidden underneath the seat. So, back seat, I can't get to it. The mask... Mess is like somebody said, Hey, is your eyes bothering you with a mask? Yeah, it does something to my mask. My you also blink and do this all the time. So, and he has contacts in, and the AC's blowing in his I eyeballs have all the time. A contact in. Yeah, his AC's blowing in his eyes all the time. And no one's ever. Um, and he's broken his nose several times. What does that have to do with any of this? Well, I think your nose bothers you. So, lay off the honey. He can't help They weren't it. being mean. They said, Hey, are purpose. your eyes. It wasn't a mean comment. Oh. There was but one you I should saw. lay off me. The people that are, the people that are mean to me, you should lay off of me. Thank you. Thank you. Whoa, this is. This is it. This is heavy. Feel that. That's a lot of food. It's not a small bag like that Sonic bag. That is. A it's heavy a small bag, bag, but it's heavy. Oh, huh? we have been okay, thinking be about this. that. Um. Uh, the pretzel. Yeah, that pretzel. So good. Okay. The Sonic pretzel. I've determined that, that the pretzel is a breadstick. I think that's what it is. It's like Somebody, the equivalent of a soft, mushy breadstick. It's not pretzel flavored at all. Because I'm not a huge pretzel flavor fan. are you talking fan. about Sonic when we're eating just saying it because a follow up. Because I didn't give justice to that pretzel because the pretzel was not pretzely. Somebody said. It was. They just said that the pretzel. I believe they said the pretzel has. Uh, a jillion calories? No, like oh. something like maybe it had vanilla in it or something. They said something about it, it's why it was so good. good. Oh, it's so good. Okay. But with that in mind, let's have a a burrito. I have to put this up here, cover that. Should I park elsewhere? Yeah, you should because you've only you parked insist. once. You've only parked if once. If you insist, I will park. Okay. Um, I think you should park somewhere that has a little shade so the phone doesn't get Watch our food. a it jillion might, degrees. It might fall off. 
Okay, that's just probably the regular avocado. It's hot too. Wow, wow. All of this regular is super avocado hot. hot. Well, did you get, oh, I got an avocado then. This is the, this is my keto avocado burrito. Okay. Look at the size difference. That, that's considerable. Mine so, is some juice. There's juice everywhere in mine. They have an avocado burrito, and then they have this keto one. I think it's because it has the super greens in it. Oh, okay. If we see greens, though we have no idea what's in a tinga. So, let's see. Yep. Oh, I see cabbage. That's going to be super greens. Oh, did we get salsa? I don't even know what mine is, what I took a bite of. No idea. Oh, we did get salsa. Hmm. Pretty good, but I'm gonna say. Let me try yours. It's a little dry. That's too dry for you. Not with this. Mm. That's the green salsa. It's avocado. This green salsa is really good. With some cilantro. Mm. Maybe jalapeno or something in there. Something that makes it spicy and it's really good. Here, try mine. I don't, I don't know mind having what's in it. Here, green, let me get to the meat of the burrito. I don't mind having green or super greens, but I don't know. This mm. one has too many super greens. I have a bite of mine. I don't know what's in it, but mine is Do wet I need salsa because on it? it has beans in it. And it's their, their refried beans or whatever they're not refried. They're really good. Oh, that's really good. Tinga burrito. That get is, this. Really good. That's really good. But I don't know what it is, but I I'm, like it. I'm keto in it. Yeah, hers doesn't need anything on it. It's juicy. Hmm. So okay. I don't even know what tinga means. It means yum. You know okay. how I spelled it? Yeah. You're done with that already? I'm just going to show them what a taco al carbon is. Okay. Oh. Have you, anybody ever had, and I don't know where all they would sell this, but I've had it before in, uh, in Chula Vista. And it was. That was an onion. I'm it was um, a taco made from the head, the meat in the head of the cow. No, I wouldn't eat it. It was really good. I know you would eat it, but I think it was like taco cabeza or something like that. Taco al carbon. I was with Nacho, and he said, "Hey, you got to try this." And I said, "That's delicious. What is it? Because it's the meat of the head. It's like the cheek and the whatever. It's the meat. It's in the cow's head." Okay, in California. That way, you just eat the cow slowly. Well, we should say Mexico. Because it's still alive. California's influence here with the tacos is from Mexico. But everywhere that has tacos, they're influenced from Mexico. No. You do know that tacos, I'm assuming, are, now that I said that, I could be wrong. That's it true. Could they some, could be Ecuador. They could be wherever. You never know no, where else might possibly have They're from Mexico. Tacos. Tacos are from Mexico. they got to be from other places, too. Other oh, places have to have, to have a taco. This. I know there was something that we consider a Mexican food. That wasn't from Mexico, but I don't think it's tacos. I think tacos are definitely from. I can't believe we're debating if tacos are from Mexico. No, I'm just saying that, that they're from Mexico. Our California influence is not California tacos. It's from Mexico. Well, it's because we're from, on the border. It's from uh, like because I know Mexico. That part of Mexico. Texas West, tacos are different than Texas, Arizona, New Mexico. They all have a different flair. All those borders. Yeah, it's different. See, the, the best. And they're all from Mexico. Is California. The best is Southern California. Yeah. Um, without a doubt, hands down. But El Pollo Loco is not authentic Mexican food mm -mm. at all. Mm -mm. But they have delicious chicken. Anyway, so street tacos a healthy choice, are really popular, I guess, like in, I don't know if it's everywhere in Mexico, but for sure in... You've never been to Tijuana, huh? Yeah, Tijuana is where I'm saying. is like there's I'm sure all kinds of towns and stuff have it, but you go and you get these little teeny tacos. They don't have much on them. They just have some onions, some cilantro, Mm -hmm. And then chicken, and that's it. And they're dry little taco they are. with. Show them how tiny. big that is. They're tiny ones, and you just get a bunch of them. Compared to this, and they're in a little teeny soft taco. They I'm usually have two thinking. tortilla cell tortilla shells like this. This one has three. If you having an authentic street taco, and is then you a put treat. that salsa. You can sit there, like in Tijuana, Ensenada, wherever, and you just can you can scarf those things down. Mm. And you know what else is good? It's like a taco cart. They make like a. Um, um, a cocktail like the shrimp cocktail thing. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh man, ceviche! Ceviche is one of my favorite things. I'm starting to think about it now. I'm wanting it. The weird thing mm. though, I won't go to Mexico because many people that we know have had lots of relatives who've been kidnapped. <laughs> 
seriously, for ransom. One of our friends that we worked it with, happens. a girl that we were, I know it does, but a girl that we worked with, it didn't used to be that way. When I went to college, people would just go down there because you didn't only be 18 to drink. They would go there and it was no big deal. But you later, be 18, you can it be got 12. kind of crazy. So we've had friends, that, remember Ari, Ariella's mm -hmm. dad? Mm -hmm. Her dad got kidnapped down there and he's, he's, he's from, from Mexico. Mexico. He got kidnapped. And held for ransom, and they sent him a fing her them a finger, if mm -hmm. I remember right. It was a finger, yep, and something else. And I can't remember. I think that they did end up scrounging up enough money somehow and paid for him to get released. Yeah. Okay. Um, my dad's friend from school went down there to get prescription meds or something. I don't. Who knows what the real story was? But um, he ended up getting arrested. Somebody stole his identity or his um his was in, passport uh, and stuff. He, he got ended thrown. up like in up by Cabo somewhere. Yeah. He was way down in Mexico. He went to the police to um, get his, you know, hey, someone stole my passport, all my stuff from my car, blah, blah, blah. They arrested him and held him. And he was in jail for a couple years. And they don't feed you in jail there. You have to have somebody send you money so you can buy food they through the window. You, you got to pay for it. You have to pay through it through the window. Like vendors will come by and feed the people there. So that's how he was. I don't know where in Mexico he was. But... How crazy is that? So all these stories that we've heard, I'm, I'm not going there. I'm gonna get kidnapped. Well. And I know nobody does because there's billions of people go all the time. But I'm too scared. I don't speak any Spanish. With that said, mm -hmm. I've been there many, many I've times. I've been there before too. When I was in second grade, mm -hmm. me and a friend did school and like the bus, school bus showed up, we didn't get on it. And I remember my sister, That's I remember great. looking at that bus and she was at the window yelling and I think she was mouthing, I'm going to tell mom. Yeah. The bus left and we just had a major adventure that day. I'm not going to go into all the details, but we did a lot that day. And at one point, this was in San Ysidro. We, we, our school, you could see the, like you could walk over to a, the border, like the Mexico was right there. And um, mm -hmm. we walked, me and my friend walked across the border. And his, I think it was his grandma or somebody was over there. And she took us in and fed us, yelled at us, because she wanted us to, to go back. But um, we, I remember getting the ice cream out of the guy running, doing the ice cream thing with the dry ice. I was real yeah. fascinated with the dry ice. Got the ice creams. And then ultimately we came back home and we got home super late. Like, it was dark. Late at night, yeah. That was an adventure that I paid for. Somebody's having a loud dream. She's snoring. So anyways, I was a little kid. I didn't get molested. I didn't get kidnapped or anything like that. I didn't. Thanks for telling us that. <laughs> anything could have happened to me. I could have been sent into the sex trade for all I know. no idea where mm -mm. you were. Mm -mm. But I, my dad was deployed. Yeah, deployed, he said. And my mom, boy, that was, it had to be brutal on her. Mm-hmm. But... Anyway, that's our El Pollo Loco story. Yeah. <laughs> El Pollo Loco, we feel, is a healthier option. Yeah. Their chicken's grilled or roasted I got the or keto. whatever. I got you keto. got a keto. But um, I'm not they don't keto, fry their though. stuff. It's just good. And it, every time we go, it's good. It's very salty, though. I'm not a keto -er. I think every... Fast food's going to be salty? Yeah. You know, they have to preserve it. But this right here. The Egyptians the green. invented fast food with their their way of preserving bodies and stuff. What? I'm, I know it sounds crazy, but it's true. They had fast food, the Egyptians. Hold on a minute. Mm-hmm. The Egyptians invented fast food by the way of their pre preserving the bodies. Mm-hmm. May I have a napkin? <laughs> I don't have any. No, here's what happened. Because you can't just throw that little nugget out you there. You left a taco, no. Well, I want to so go back to this burrito. Out, that was they figured out how to preserve bodies, which then some innovative, you know, entrepreneurial Egyptians said, hey, we can preserve food like this too. Let's do it. Don't you think maybe the food happened first and they said maybe we can do something with the bodies? No, because the body thing was important. Food's real important too, Because they knew they too, were though. going to another realm and they had to, they wanted their body to be preserved. And they also took people with them. They took a bunch of servants with them. Well. And those people didn't die naturally. <clears throat> they also. Why are we talking about that when we're eating? They also think the pyramids might be a battery 
to for the aliens, a power source for the aliens. So there we There's go. There's a lot of. They invented fast food. Days. They invented fast fast food. And, and they were capable of building pyramids. They did have batteries, by the way. You know that they Yeah, I do know batteries. Okay. But the pyramid itself might mm -hmm. not have been a burial ground. It might have been a conduit for the powering up um, the nope. UFOs. Don't, these don't are all you these things he odd? listens to it all don't the time. Don't you think it's odd that we have pyramids in every every continent? And we and there might be some in Antarctica under that ice for all we know. But do you know they're everywhere? Yeah. And it's because the aliens were driving their Teslas around and they needed to go charge up between place to place. Most people are going to know that they're going to think you're silly because they know, hey, come on, Steph. There is something going on. You don't think Look it's similar the to the fast food? Have you ever seen the, the, the drawings there with where you would see them flying something? They had drawings of people in a craft flying it. They also had them with domes over their heads. Like an astronaut. Like an astronaut, yeah. Man, I need this salsa is so good. You have napkins all over your lap. I don't know. But Oh, you're looking for salsa. I thought you're looking for napkins again. No. This. Yeah, that salsa is the bomb. I love it. Okay. This doesn't even need it. It's filled with juice. Would you get that again? Yeah, except it's heavy and huge. I would only eat like as much as I've eaten maybe of it. The rest I'm too full. I'm gonna be full. It is really big. Like if so but that's a big burrito. Mine, I know. I'm not eating it super fast, but mine's really it's good. It's perfect size. It's a little dry but because of the... all the super greens. And then this in there. Is your head sweating yet? No. Mm. It's not hot and spicy it's at all. It's not hot today? No, if it is, I'm not tasting mm, it. That's good. Yeah, it's not hot at all today. Perfect for you. Mm. Okay. Well, anyway, if you have an El Pollo Loco, you could check out. Everything on there is good. Really good. The little taco... The tacos al carbon the are really good. The street tacos are really good. Mm -hmm. The burritos go are good. The El Pollo Bowl is the most famous thing there, I think. The Pollo Bowl. And it's rice, beans, I chicken to on really top. I really like that thing. Some onions and cilantro. And then salsa. And you just mix it up or whatever. It's delicious. You know what though? Like I, I used to really like it. And then it kind of... Do you notice You got how, sick of rice this way. No, do you notice how... Like when you like a certain fast food... They, there's when they make changes. I don't know if it's new ownership or they're trying to save money. Do you think they, they change? They change something about it. There was hmm. something changed. I don't think so. I think or it tastes very similar. I just got sick of it. You got. I haven't sick had of one it. in a while, but I really used to. I used to. You love got that. really sick of rice, is what happened. That was a huge bite. Hmm. How mm. fast can you quick to count to thirty? The kids were doing that yesterday. Oh man, that that was spicy. That. This one? This salsa? Yeah. Uh oh. Head sweat. Head sweat. I'm alright. I don't have to touch it, do I? No. Okay. It's not that bad. <laughs> wow. That was good. Okay. Well, thanks what, for joining us. What happened us. to this? You eat it. You better use the. T There's another one in there. Eat a whole fresh oh, one. No. Honey, you forgot the tin foil. Here. You messed up. I was just Here. gonna you slam need some it of this real quick. You need some of this in there. I didn't think. They didn't really get to see hot. that. The way that you I know, but so these are she ate probably less than half of it. It's just a tiny little taco. Mm -hmm. We usually get four of them, maybe easy to eat. Yeah, I usually get rid of one of the tortillas when I eat it because mm. too many. Mm. I know. Okay. Would you prefer the thing about this? It's not like why can't people eat hamburgers every day, but they can't eat this every day? This isn't greasy, there's like zero grease. It's chicken, it's not deep fried. Good point. It's a chicken. Hmm. hmm. Am I the only one that needs to drink? <coughs> yes. When I, when I eat? No one <coughs> drinks more than you when you eat, and nobody uses more napkins on the planet Earth except Mila. Mila's working on except it. Except Mila, than you. Mila's coming up. I will no, use literally no napkin usually. Um, I don't get. I mean, I spill stuff on me, but that's just cleansiness, not whatever. But did you want some of my... Did I eat all that without giving you some of it? No, I took a bite of it. I agreed it was dry. Okay. Would you choose that one again or mine? Um, I don't even know what was in yours, but whatever. I don't care. Super green. So, so wait. What so I'm saying, saying is, is... I think I just got like a, a high off of this. I think you just got carb overload. Mm-hmm. Sink it in. Okay. What you're saying is what? You just like... Um, 
Okay, if Why we, do I need to drink? Because. Do you not? What, you don't want to share that with them? No. <laughs> That's all been edited out. Um, no, but it, I think. Why, other, why are you editing that out? Why are you so. It, what no, that's a hole. Happened? That's a hole in my pants because Putty did it when she was younger. So I keep wearing the same Stop pants. Stop blaming it on Putty. I keep wearing this. That's a tooth. I keep wearing the same pants. She ruined my shorts. And the same really shirts like. over and over and over while she's in this bitey stage. She's way better. Um, because she's ripping my clothes, you know, yeah. getting holes in them. So I don't want to wear normal clothes. So I keep wearing the same couple pairs of pants. You eating it? No. Oh. Okay. Give that. We're gonna send this to one of you guys. Whoever, <laughs> <laughs> whoever leaves, yeah. whoever leaves the funniest comment, we're gonna send this to you. No. We're gonna <laughs> gross. We're gonna we're gonna uh, allegedly send this to you. It's a street taco. May or may not have for, a finger in it. Yeah, for the funniest comment, we probably won't send it to you, yeah. but act like we're going to. Okay. And. Say something funny. Okay. But, anyways. I must say, you know, that fast food was really fast. It actually. Sonic is not. It actually was, and there wasn't a line. But no. Sometimes, is that a bad sign? Like, hey, nobody wants to eat there? No. They, oh. Their food is ready. Sonic cooks it to order, and that's what a lot of you guys said. So, they have well, to. That's better if it's cooked to order than having it set there. We just ate something that's been sitting there for a long time. Well, it's lunchtime. I've become a massive burper since we've been doing like freaking hot stuff. You haven't burped since we did that last one. I know. All right. El Pollo Loco. Now El Pollo carb. Loco. I am having a carb. Are you getting tired now? There goes a the police dog. Yeah, canine. Okay, well, anyway, thanks for joining us. I, I don't know why we're sharing our fast food experience with you, but you can at least see what you have at El Pollo they Loco. They wanted to know. I know people did say in the comments they wanted us to go to El Pollo Loco, and we ordered so, stuff we didn't ever, we'd never had before. And that's fun. Yeah, never. Eat, I've never eaten keto. We did eat these before, so we got that. I got those in case this was not good for me. I needed to have something to yeah. eat. She's been holding that the same way this whole time. It's, it's, it was a moist one, and if I pull it down, it's ripped here. It has a hole. It's gonna split. It was so. very. She's like this the whole time. Yeah. They I need, suck. I need to drink, and she needs to hold like. That. No, I normally it's gone. But I'm not going to eat the whole thing. and um, In front of people? No, I'm not going to eat the whole thing. You know, I will be in carb overload like you. All right. Fair enough. All right, so this was El Pollo Loco. Don't know about their dessert. Oh, chorizo. Chorizo? I mean, a churro. <laughs> a churro for dessert. I don't like chorizo. But I do. I don't like churros either. Neither do you. I know, but it's fair to, to do a dessert and say, hey. It's right there. Let's go. No, I can't. Wait, McDonald's birthday cake. You guys told us. I'm going to do it in a different video. All right. We will do the McDonald's birthday cake because somebody wanted to do that. But that'll be a separate video because I don't know if I can handle it right now. That's true. I probably could. Well, all we have know. to have is a bite. Good point. We gotta see what the heck is it all about. Is it in a wedge? Is it in a square? Does it have sprinkles? All right, we're gonna go get a McDonald's birthday. I can't even speak right now. Then what we'll just save to it me? for a different day.